Buddhism is the largest religion practiced in China. And it was introduced to this country by merchants traveling here from India along the Silk Road. Today, there are an estimated 100 million Buddhists in China and around 20,000 temples. Here at this Buddhist shrine, these men and women honor their ancestors with brightly colored strips of fabric. I was told we circled the shrine three times as three is a lucky number representing important stages in life, birth, marriage, and death. As a foreign traveler, I'm encouraged to ask for a blessing. I wish for a safe journey on my tour through China. Before we leave, the troupe launches into another beautiful Mongolian performance. I can close my eyes and imagine being in an ancient time as music drifts across the landscape. To cap it all off, we're offered ceremonial wine. So I'm told this has special herbs that make your body strong. So I said, I'll have another. I have past time, you should drink. Because I'm so big? <laughs> no, I have the past time. OK. Hey, if it's a custom. Oh, yeah. Uh. Another one? Really? I think that's probably good. Six. <laughs> I'm already four in. What's another two, right? OK, so if I've got this straight, it's another numbers thing. Three trips around the shrine and six cups of wine. That makes nine, the most important number of all, signifying eternity. Well, there's a big difference between one and three and six. Bayeng thinks I may have had a little too many lucky numbers. Now it's a party. Mm. Except I need to go. 